Hey guys, it's Stack here and I'm back with a brand new Forza Horizon 4 video and in this one I have got the best money making glitch that you can use. I've seen a few videos get posted and also I had a few people comment on my video saying that they uh, that there was a glitch way to do it. So I, I've searched and I've searched and I've searched and I finally found a video. It wasn't in English, I have no idea who it was but I watched it and I've learned how to do it so I'm going to show you how to do it. Now you don't have to do it on a certain type of race obviously I don't have Goliath unlocked at this point so I'm going to be doing it on the Hollywood Park circuit so that I can level up my street racing at level 20 so that I'm then able to do it on the Goliath now me doing it on the Hollywood Park circuit it takes me about maybe with all the loading into the race and stuff it takes me about 35 seconds to get about half a million credits but then once I do it on Goliath it's about 35 seconds for 5 million credits definitely worth it but you do need someone else in your lobby to do it so obviously me I've got my friend Eric ship and only one person is going to be making the money so if you're the host you're going to be making money so go to your race start off PvP and choose my convoy you can just head over to the custom events and select mine if you can't be bothered otherwise hit the create blueprint Make sure you choose anything goes so you can pick any vehicle and then also make sure you choose the open class restrictions so that any type of vehicle can be chosen. From here head over to event settings and you're going to change the teams to on and the number of laps to 50. So I mean it can take over 7-8 hours to do the Goliath for 50 laps but with this method nah, 35 seconds with the loading into the race as well and your friend connecting just to get the 5 million definitely worth it but if you can't actually be bothered with it just head on over to the custom events search for mine here it's just called money 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 on this track and you'll be able to use it I also have my own for the Goliath if you wait until the end and you can see what that is it's just a quicker way to get into it save it and then you can use it straight away every single time okay so once you're loading into the race how you're gonna do this is if you're the one making the money you do not have to do anything. You can drive a little bit, you can sit there and watch. It's completely up to you. I don't think I actually move in this just to show you you don't actually have to do anything. But your friend, whoever is in the lobby, the one helping you, all he has to do is simply drive through the finish line and then quit the race. So for him, he's just going to back out. But for you, because it was a team race, once the other teams quit, you win. So it goes straight to the finish screen and you'll see right here, Eric Ship left the convoy and for me here, there's my money reward for 35 less seconds. Two and a half million straight away just doing that. I was using an in, uh, influence bonus car. I think without it you get about 89,000. That's roughly what I get without it. But I was using this so that I could level up my street racing really quickly and hit it to road racing 20 so that I could get the Goliath. So next up is the Goliath now that I've unlocked it. You can see my money there in the top right and check it again after the race. But after I did the last one before driving to this, I went and bought the house to fast travel. That's how much I made just doing uh, four races in the other one because I easily had enough with extra. So it's exactly the same setup as before. Make sure you do open and unrestricted. Otherwise, just head on over to the custom events and choose this one right here, the Money Goliath. So mine is already set to the team racing and 50 laps so it'll work straight away when you choose it. So now I'm going to let this run here completely unedited so that you can see I'm not cutting, I'm not skipping anything. And here you're going to see me and Eric Ship loading in to the Goliath. Once we get past our Scrandy dancing and then the race is going to begin. So. As you can see, I drive a little bit just to show you can move, it still works, but you just don't have to do anything. There's no point as you're only going to be in the race for two, three seconds. So Eric Ship has now left. It's going to tell me he's left the convoy as well in a second, just to show. All he had to do was press pause, hit the quit race, just to make sure he's not dashboarding or anything like that. And it, look at that right there, 5.345 million. That is ridiculous for only five seconds. It's so easy to earn money now and almost a million influence earned. If I had an influence boost car on, 
I might have even hit a million just in that. So you can see from the level, before I started doing this, I've only been doing it for about 10 minutes now. I was level 87 when I started it. And as you can see here, this is the, my first attempt doing it on the Goliath, okay? So before I went into this, and look at my level in the top left there. Already that high, and also I've earned about 120 odd wheel spins. I've got about 10 super wheel spins from leveling up certain parts, like car collector and stuff like that. Uh, the street racing, once you hit level 20 on that, you also get a super wheel spin. So, so from actually collecting all of these, I've managed to save up some super wheel spins, some normal wheel spins, and from that it's going to give me even more money to uh, basically buy whatever I want. So you can see that I earned just over five, just under five and a half million for the actual uh, glitch doing it on the Goliath. And I was already on a couple of million before I started it. But then by the end of this video, I managed to push myself up to around 10.5 million just from the rewards from the wheel spins. I'm not going to open them all in this. I'm going to speed it all up for you so you can see mainly what I'm getting. But just the amount of 170s, 100,000s, 120,000s I get, and then also all the cars that I'm getting, it just increases all your influence, so you're still levelling up from doing this as well. So it's a ridiculous way. Definitely give it a try if you haven't read it, and make sure you do it before it gets patched, because they have to patch this soon, because this is game-breaking right now. I can already afford the majority of the cars in the game just from doing this. So that's it for this video guys, please give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and also make sure you subscribe if you're new, I will be posting more Forza Horizon 4 videos soon. But for now, I'm out.